throws to stay in rhythm for their offense. Marshall throwing on first down is complete to Marcus Davis. Started out very shaky. Obviously, a lot of rain and weather probably impacted the performance. They dump it off to Trey Mason, and he gets loose into the second down. Out across midfield and final. Can also make you miss in space and get yards after the catch. They go back to Mason. They'll carry it this time. Mason rushed for over a thousand yards. Senior center, junior center, I should say, for Auburn. Marshall on the keeper. First down and more. Inside the 15-yard line. Side to the left, and Jay Prost did a good job leading. Mason down at the one. And you could see that capability with that inside run. First and goal. Touchdown, Trey Mason. <laughs> to Corey Grant, two to them. Marshall throws on first down. It's Sammy Coates. Second and four. It is Artis Payne. He is a bulldozer. First down to the 41. He has been a great trying to work better and in concert with one another. Marshall wants to throw on first down again, and he's going deep. Sammy Coates is down there, but can't haul it in. Strong of an arm. Marshall on second and ten throws again. Complete. I've had their work cut out for him tonight. Up dropped. Mark the ball. Third possession for Auburn and Corey Grant. He's listed as the number three running back. Marshall the play fake. Sets, throws. Man, wide open. It's the tight end. But if Marshall's able to put the ball on him. Good. Under 10 minutes to go before half, Marshall. Leaves a couple. Trey Mason tried to bounce around. The tackler stayed on it. After further review, the ruling is the runner's elbow was down with the ball at the 28 and a half yard line. It'll be third down, one and a half yards to go at the 28 and a half yard line. Backs. Mason got it. Team Zach Mettenberger having a great year at quarterback for LSU. Trey Mason. Complete. Marshall takes off. Finds a seam, first down, and he's across midfield. Into the backfield to give it a play action look. After the 17-yard gain, they go back to the steady Trey Mason. He swaps the defense just enough. Stepping up his play. Third and two, Mason churning ahead. Played inside, right here. Marshall, left all alone, first down and more. Running back, and instead, he pulls it and gets wide open on the edge. Now Cameron shot his pain. He's going to take his turn. They like to keep it on the ground when they get inside the 20. Marshall walks in untouched touchdown. You know, it's interesting to hear Dean Lee break down. The throw on first down. It's a screen to Ricardo Lewis, his first touch. Boy, that almost looked like a busting. Some formational adjustments. Come back with a Sammy Coates. Good run after the catch. Spins his way across the midfield stripe. And the officials might not working. That's Mark Curls, our referee. And it's Greg. Marshall. Defensively. Tigers start at the 25 after the touchback. Marshall. Keeper. Bad stinger. 
down both of his arms, but he looks like he's going to be fine. Marshall to throw, has a man open. It's Trey Mason along the sideline. To the 39th. Cody Pruitt. And now he'll run. Lowers his head and gets inside the third. The pace play. Screen. Bray. Steps out of one tackle. Dragged down. Morsa. On second and six. First down. Marshall keeps it. Out at the 11. For Marshall. And Mason again. Gus Malzahn goes right back to it. He'll keep it again. Same play. If we don't see a QB run. He sends Grant in motion behind him. Fakes the handoff to him, keeps it. Touchdown, Nick Marshall. This was able to get off the slide on their SEC schedule, their first SEC win. Corey Grant looking for operating room near this sideline. Kyle Frazier lined up as a receiver to the right. Pass is caught. With his legs when the pocket collapses. Mason hit behind the line of scrimmage and he goes down. We can't say for this old Miss defensive unit. Cameron Artis Payne pick up three or four on Never first down. Has done a good job of rolling players in to keep him fresh. Trey Mason, he's had a spectacular night. He's got a first down and more. He has to run the zone read offense. He's done a good job here tonight. Mason again. How did Marshall get out of there? A first down inside the run game. Well, that's going to be a loss, and it's fumble. Picked up by Ole Miss. Denzel Kimdichi. Loaded in the run game tonight. Marshall, the handoff to Ricardo Lewis. And the receiver with a big play. As it collapses down, there's been some poor tackling as well. Cameron Artis Payne. Trouble tonight, and now a penalty marker. In fact, several penalty markers. And they went tumbling. The snap. It, offside, number 56, defense made contact. The five-yard penalty results in a first down. Brandon Fulce, the tight end. Lined up wide to the top of your screen. Sprinting out is Marshall. First down. It has been that kind. And around to Quan Bray. He's bottled up. Lucky to get back to the original line of scrimmage. And a... Mason. That last series, but he's back out there. Hands it off to Cameron Otis. Payne, big hole up the middle. Ball comes up. And it looks like Ole Miss has recovered. A great catch. Best field position to start a series for Auburn tonight. And Mason plunges ahead. <laughs> Keeper, Marshall. He'll slide a big third and four for the Tigers. Marshall wants to throw out of the pocket throws on the run deep contact down there no flag and it lands incomplete and pinning Ole Miss deep Trey Mason after the play was over unsportsmanlike conduct unnecessary roughness number 95 defense half the distance to the goal first down on a short field Auburn trying to put Ole Miss away Mason. And milk that play clock. And give it back to Mason. And it looks to me like that's exactly what it'll end up being. And a straight handoff to Mason. A season ago, and on back to back.
But the way that the edge was played by Ellis Johnson and his defensive ends, that was the story of this ball game. Oh,